welcome back friends as we discussed in last tutorial we will visualize the visualize this logic so let's create visualization click on visualization tab on the same screen we will visualize the logic written in last tutorial we will copy paste this this logic for will be for motor control this logic the text will be motor control motor control uh, here only name of variable will be changed my npuu and plc prg these are the m input 1 m input 2 m output 1 m output 2 these are my actual parameters so i have to assign those variables to the visualizing elements so here click on double click on input 1 uh, we will give name to this motor input one and the colors will be same only my variables will be changed clear this variable press f2 you will populate with the input assistant in plc prg we have the m input 1 click on ok and for input set it to toggle variable and press F2 and select this variable M input 1 motor input 1 and click OK for this as well this will be my motor input 2 motor input 2 and here you can assign the color to the field here inside flow inside color here is a white when there is no bit is high when bit gets high the button will turn into green Uh, for which bit you want to make the change you want to ma make the color of the button that you have to mention here so in my case I wanted to change color when M input 2 bit is high so I choose that bit variable I can control I, I can copy this variable and Rest it here. And click on OK. will increase the length of the button
uh, in this uh, case I have four output so I will copy paste this control C control V we will adjust the equal distance here are my four output for output uh, we have to just change the variable names press F2 you will pop up with the input assistance so this is my output 1 click OK this will be my output 2 and change the text of this to output 3 click ok this will be my output 4 We are done with the visualization. Control save. Rebuild the project. Make sure that there are no errors. And we will run this program. And we will simulate our this logic. size of the window so that we can visualize it better go to plc prg resize this is our function block control
you ladies and ladies. Now everything you can see in one window. Now let's uh, control this from our uh, visualization. Uh, this is my both inputs are uh, false. My Q1 is true. Now I will make I2 high. So output 2 is true. Here you can see my output 2 is true. And same changes took place in the PLC PRG as well. Now I will make this uh, input to we will checking this condition now for output 3 I will make this low and make input 1 is high we did some mistake in motor input 1 so let's check that we motor input 1 in variables m input 1 uh, we forgot to assign the variable name of the input press F2 and give your m input 1 now it should run and go online login online run. now we will check checking for third condition input 1 is high and input 2 is low, my output 3 is high when my both inputs are true, my output 4 is true so you can check it from here as well output 3 output 2 output 4 and output 1. thank you guys thanks for watching please stay tuned for the uh, next assignment